Howdy y'all and welcome. Welcome to Farming Simulator 17. This is actually Sosnovka. And if you'll notice, I have a lot of money. But that's only because these are just tutorial videos or informational videos. So, you have to let me know what you think about these. I'm going to try to do these. And I was basically doing my Let's Play series. Hope you, hopefully you've been watching that. But, and I bought the new pickup. And then I got to realizing that it doesn't actually give you a preview of what all the options for the pickup look like. And I'm going to do, this video is about this pickup, the new one. The, what is it called? The Lizard Pickup TT. Okay, we're going to go over all the options it gives you. Not all the colors, but the colors are kind of like a given. You can just look and see what color they are. This is the standard truck right here. This is what you buy. This is standard standard, basically is what it's called. And then we'll go over here. Let's go through the wheels. The wheels are only called design 1, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So I have all of them lined up in order here. This is number 1. So just take note of what the wheels look like and you can kind of fast forward rewind whatever I should go I'm gonna try to go through them fairly quick because this is the only difference this is wheel one okay this is wheel three and I'm only doing this just so you guys you know don't have to buy it and then you know exit out resave this is wheel four wheel five and if I'm real pro I'll put numbers on the screen but you know Wheel 6, wheel option number 7, which I think is what I put on my truck, which actually looks really nice. I got lucky, I guess. And wheel number 8, which actually looks really good too. As far as I can tell, all the actual tires look the same. The wheels are different though. Okay. I could do all the wheel colors, but I don't know. I don't want to go through all that. And then you have five different options as far as the color stripe package. Okay, the options go single stripe, twin stripe, design one, two, and three. Okay, so single stripe looks like this. It actually looks pretty neat. It's actually got three stripes, but it's one big stripe and then two small stripes. It looks like it's on the hood, the roof, and then there's nothing on the bed. There's nothing on the bed or on the tailgate of any of them. Okay, so that's just kind of a standard thing. So that's the single stripe. This is a double stripe. This is what I put on my truck in my Let's Play. Give you kind of like a walk around. This video is not going to be very long, as you can tell. But I just figured I'd go over it real quick. That way you guys could see this, watch it really fast, whatever. All right. And uh, this design one looks like, okay, the roof is black. The doors are black. And then I think that's it. It doesn't look any different. I know for a fact... Oh, okay, here we go. That's a difference. So this one, the roof and the doors are both black. Okay, this one, the roof... Or no. This one, the doors and the hood are black. The options are black. Okay, if it's black, that means I changed it. Okay, I'll just explain really quick what I mean. So if you go in here and you buy this, I basically just changed this to black, and then this is the different options. Okay. Just to make that very clear, so if it is the the, white, the truck is white, the option is black, just to make it stand out more. So that one's the roof and the doors, doors, hood. It looks like all three. Okay, doors, roof, hood. Not sure why you'd ever want your truck to look like this, but you could probably do really cool color patterns. You know, it'd be nice if you could combine them maybe between the stripes and the door packages and stuff like that. Um, I am gonna also do a video on the other rodeo there's not quite as many options um because I, I guess i could just include those in this just because there's not a whole lot of options going on with it um like because i think the engine size doesn't make a difference we'll go ahead and include it in this i was going to do a different video but um i don't think i'm going to now i don't know why i bought the first one you guys already know what the first one looks like that's what you start the game with Okay, design two, design three, and then design four, I think is it. I don't know. There's a bunch of them, aren't there? I think there's eight. There are eight. Can you buy it? 
There's a store, eight. How many are in here? Are there eight in here? There's not eight in here. Okay, well, I'll just do that in a different video, because I'm not going to take the time to sit here and... Oh, they're out there. Oh, that's really cool. Okay, so you got tons of overexplosive space then. Well, let's just look at them. All right, so you got the rodeo, the engine 140, or the 100, I think, is what you start with. The 140, which these don't look any different, so that's not really that big of a deal. So then your wheel options are wheel 2, which is actually what... You, that's a standard wheel. Okay, that's a standard wheel. Should have spaced these. This is wheel 2. Wheel 3. Um, wheel 4. We can get down here and look at it. This is wheel 4. If you want to go customize your truck. I didn't realize you could actually upgrade your old truck. Um, so 5, 6, 7, 8, right? So this is wheel 5. And then this is wheel 6. And then this is wheel 7. So that kind of looks like the wheel 7. So I think all the wheels actually look the same. Right? So this is 5. Where is 5 over here? That would be 8, 7, 6, 5. Okay, so all the wheels actually look the same. All the options are the same. Okay, so never mind. I'll probably just cut this video back there. So anyway, this has been... This has been a look at the pickups, at all the pickup options. All the wheels for the old trucks are the same options as the new trucks, okay? But the new trucks have stripes and doors and all that good stuff. I hope you have enjoyed this video. It has been a little bit um, confusing because I actually added the old trucks, but that's okay. You guys understand. I'm trying to show you everything I can. I was going to do two different videos, but it's just it's just as well that I didn't because of the fact that the options are exactly the same. Okay. Um, so, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, hit the like button, and I will continue to try to do more informational and tutorial videos as they come out and as I discover things. This is The Butcher Man, and as always, good day to you all.